Good morning, Stratford. I'm Kelly Grace Perrin. And I'm Caitlin Epps. Today is Tuesday, August 30th. It's a sea day. There are no birthdays in the upper school today. Today's menu in the Prentice Robinson cafeteria is fried catfish, steamed carrots, cheese grits, roasted vegetables, cornmeal fried shrimp, and breaded mozzarella cheese sticks. Here is today's weather forecast. This year's homecoming court was announced at Monday's assembly. Here is a report. This year's homecoming court was announced on Monday at the assembly. There are eight senior girls and eight senior boys. The senior girls are Langley Ann Faulkner, Kate Frutiker, Jean Hightower, Clark Jones, Gracie Jorgensen, Edie Sharpton, Sophia Tang, and Canberra Thong Sing Chan. The senior boys are Marshall Butler, Andy Cheek, Liam Fickling, West Kovacs, Eli Miskall, Kel Stevenson, Max Strickland, and Hampton Yarbrough. The junior representatives were Christopher Evans and Callie Evans. The sophomore representatives are Stebbin Horn and Molly Edward Seagraves. The freshman representatives are Clay Jones and Hannah Dodd. Reporting for the Stratford Gazebo, I'm Will Tiller. The French Club has an announcement about the upcoming trip to France this spring. Good morning, I'm Kate Hatcher and this week on Good Morning Stratford, students who are going on the school trip to France next spring will present cities in the itinerary. Today is the City of Light, Paris. I'm Carly Nelson and the first stop in France for the 2023 trip is Paris. The group will arrive in Paris on Friday and spend three days visiting famous monuments before traveling to other areas in France that will be announced over the next couple of days. One of the monuments we will see is the Eiffel Tower where we are climb our way to the top. I'm Blaine. I'm excited to see the city from the top of the tower. We will also visit the Louvre, which is the most visited monument in the world that holds famous works of art like the Mona Lisa. Our school counselor, Ms. Gina Chalfa, has more about inaugural day of when at social. I'm Kay Frutiker reporting for the Stratford Gazebo, and I'm here with the upper school counselor, Ms. Chalfa. So, Ms. Chalfa, what do we need to know about when at social? So this year we are having a campus-wide focus on promoting student well-being and mental health. And so we have purchased this curriculum called When It's Social, where um, your homeroom teachers are going to be doing a lesson each month. And these lessons focus on educating you all on how to use technology and healthy positive ways. And these lessons will also help you build important life skills. So we are kicking off our first Win It Social lesson this Wednesday. In addition, we are having a mental wellness speaker named Taylor Wesley, who will be coming to talk to us all about her own struggles with mental illness and how she um, has overcome and dealt with her mental illness in uh, positive, healthy ways. Here is the schedule for Wednesday's assembly. The Eagles football team will have its home opener against Riverside Military Academy on Thursday night at the Cantrell Stadium. Here's a report. I'm Henley London reporting for the Stratford Gazebo and I'm here with head football coach Chance Jones. And coach, uh, what are your thoughts on last Friday's game against Westfield? I think I was certainly happy with the results. Um, anytime that you can go down to Perry and have a running clock in the fourth quarter, I think you've done something. It's a, it's a tough place to play, and uh, I feel like the guys played really hard, and I'm excited about the next one. And uh, what are your expectations for next Thursday's game against Riverside Military? Well, I expect um, the team to play about the same. You know, we don't have different expectations for different games. We just we go out there and we do our best. If you're a new student and need help setting up our community service app, please see Ms. Alex Miner in the college office. Here are today's additional announcements. Have a wonderful day, Eagles. Have a wonderful day, Eagles. Have a wonderful day, Eagles.